All right, so let's see if we can keep this under two minutes. Ghost pump, taste, quality, price, taste, so-so. It, it's the uh, sour watermelon flavor. The sour watermelon in their pre-workout is one of the best tasting pre-workouts I've ever had. Same thing for their blue raspberry, and I don't really even do blue raspberry anymore. Uh, but the pump tastes different than the pre-workout. It still tastes good, but it mixes really frothy. And I think that's because the ingredients that they use in here uh, to let you have a pump in the gym, it makes it kind of oxidized in the cup or in your drink as well. So it tastes probably like 7 out of 10. It's all right. Uh, mix is kind of frothy. Price. Uh, there's 20 servings in here, but if you look at the 20, there's funny. If you look at the front, there's 20. But a serving size is considered two scoops. So if you're just doing one scoop, if you're looking for a little bit of a pump, or maybe you're adding it to another supplement, you could push this out to 40. At 40 servings, it's a really good quality. At 20, it's kind of so-so. All right, so let's talk about quality. Let's talk about ingredients. It's got four grams of citrulline, right? That's the big ingredient these days for generating a pump. That is the main ingredient. It's got a little bit of arginine, which is good. But arginine has also been shown to be less absorbable than citrulline. And also, it actually decreases your body's natural levels of growth hormone. So keep that in mind if you supplement with arginine often. A little bit of taurine... Uh, and then the next big thing in here, probably the last big thing worth mentioning, the glycer pump. It's glycerol powder. There's 1.5 uh, grams of the glycerol in here. Glycerol is another really up-and-coming pump product, so it's good on that basis. I got to say with this, eh, I was so-so on the results. Uh, probably not my favorite pump product that I've ever taken. Actually, the, the pill form of the Max Exertion. Uh, by GNC. I don't think they even sell it anymore, but uh, pump was so-so. And I would say this, if you're, first of all, not doing a high rep training scheme, so if your reps are like 10 or less than 10 per set, things like that, why are you even taking something to give you a pump? Take something with creatine in it that's going to give you some strength. The Ghost size is looking like a really great product. I haven't tried that yet. It's on my shelf. I'm waiting to try it out. Uh, but if your reps are low, don't even bother with a pump product. You could maybe cycle off if you just need something mentally. But result-wise, if you're not doing high rep pump or nitric oxide products, it's not going to do a whole lot for you. If you are doing high rep, you're doing 10 reps and higher, then go ahead by all means. Try it out. See what you feel about it. And uh, leave... Uh, so your opinions on this and some other ghost products in the comments below.